This time of year, high school football teams are usually competing with themselves in the weight room. But with schools closed and a stay at home order until at least May 1st, the Springfield football team has been getting creative. We're going to do uh, two or three challenges a week. Uh, so last week between our players, uh, they, they, they had to end up taking a, a clip of themselves for 30 seconds just doing push-ups. Everyone's on board. Our whole team is like sending their videos in. We're all watching it, having a good laugh and stuff. I mean, that's definitely good for like the team bonding aspect. Guerrero is hoping something as little as push-ups will help his Tigers keep their competitive edge while being apart. We started breaking it down, I mean, by class, and well, th then they look at, well, well the, you mean the, the junior class beat the sophomore and the freshman class. How can we beat them more? Right. How can I get more? And I had a couple kids talking to him. Well, that kid, that kid had to cheat. What's well, on the video? You saw it, and it's <laughs> kind of funny to see the kids start interacting and, and, and start to see that competitive on uh, competitive level if you see someone like in your like position do like 35 push-ups and you're doing 34 that means you got to like do one more rep the next day and like just push yourself to like that aspect so you can get the spot you can get the minutes in the game so like that's how I'm looking at it. Medvik says that the challenges along with the coaches putting training schedules online are helping him get off the couch while staying at home. It's definitely giving us something to do, not just sitting on our couches and like watching TV or playing Fortnite or something. <laughs> We're definitely getting up on the ground and like doing push-ups, sit-ups and like pull-ups. I mean, it's, it's definitely something better than sitting out on our butts and doing nothing. For Sports Team 27, I'm Josh Forketic.